Is anyone else finding themselves waiting on the Crunchyroll page for the episode to come out? Because holy crap, I've just been so hyped for every single episode so far. I I find myself just not being able to wait until 10.45 in the morning, at least Pacific Standard Time. Welcome back, Rich Nation. My name is AJ, and today we are going to be reacting to Jujutsu Kaisen Episode 8. Um, the last episode, and really almost every episode so far, has been majorly hyped just ridiculous fights ridiculous just uh dark toned uh just a dark toned anime in general i am really enjoying this and i can't wait to continue if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe smash that like button hit that notification bell you can also check out my patreon at patreon.com slash ajrich123 if you want to see these episodes uncut and early along with all the other reactions i do definitely check it out and let's go ahead and start Actually, nobody does. God damn. Yes. They don't, she doesn't sound like she cares. That doesn't mean his death would be any less. What the? That is the most random question to ask. Okay, this guy's definitely on the roids. Okay, I can't disagree with that. Damn, talking about girls and ass? How did you make me like this show even more? <laughs> God damn, yes. Yes. <laughs> That's somebody I could get along with. What's the definition of half dead? <laughs> he keeps at it. That's fair. Could have just said a fat ass. <laughs> you didn't say big boobs, big ass, so you're about to get your ass kicked. Ooh. God damn! That's a burn. What? What the fuck? What the fuck? Why are we pulling out guns here? Fuck ninjutsu. Definitely some drug steroids is affecting this guy's mentality. What the fuck? So now, yes, because winged frogs are the answer to everything. God. Why are they? Okay, this shows the difference between experience here. I guess we're getting used to people crashing through buildings already. So that's why he's got the frogs. Just a little fight like this is a life or death battle. Look at all that blood. A panda's about to show you some manners. <laughs> I noticed they talk in like baseball terms. Oh, 
どうやら退屈指導士ってわけでもなさそうだ。前も出ろと。めんどくせえ。俺パンダ、人間の言葉わからない。あ<笑>、valid excuse <笑>。now you wanna try to act more like a panda。why am I slightly turned on right now。足こぼれはお互い様だろお前だって物に呪力を込めるばっかりで。術式も。ボートマキさん、こう言ってけよ、私の夏服にしてやる。Yes. The fuck? Of course he likes stuff like that. <laughs> so she's able to fight without that? Without being able to do that. That's that is a reason a lot of people use, you know, to get back at your family or to, you know, to show up everybody. She seems really strong, especially strong willed. That guy's got to be like 130. <laughs> <laughs> At least you're straightforward. I don't think he cares. <laughs> That's like her, the, her inside. She's a fangirl. What the? It's a love pose. Is there only one person in the movie theater? Or... Okay, a few... People that are already dead. Oh, God! What the fuck happened in that theater? How bad was that movie? Did they just watch Death Note? The live action? Oh, that's one of the people they showed as being strong. So they're going to go show him bodies. <laughs> Not going to lie, I, I kind of like my. Doesn't every guy want, you know, want to marry their idol? <laughs> what the hell does she have down there? Is that a piercing? Oh, it's the gun. <laughs> I don't think she's used to having girls go over there. Uh-huh. Did she like that or was she pissed? Oh, now she's a fan. Man, this episode really showed the differences in strength. You have to remember, they, they said it's a four-year school. So there's obviously going to be people that have more training that is stronger. Though the first few episodes felt like the school was empty. Like there was barely uh, anybody there or any, you know, other schools or a, any other... Um, just other people in general. That's why I thought it was a little, it felt empty. But now seeing that there's other special grades as well, and that makes it seem like they could be even, you know, even stronger than what we've seen so far. I, the, um, the power differences and the power scaling in this might be a bit different. It's kind of hard to tell right now, uh, just because we've only seen so much. 
and from the fights we've seen i i always feel like how strong is this person compared to this person how strong is this person compared to this person we see gojo fight but we we just saw you know the the kids fight the other people and that per that thing wasn't anywhere near as strong as this other guy and this other curse was stronger than this it's just i'm trying to kind of gauge the the strength of everybody um my big thing is i i think what really sells this show for me is uh, obviously the fights the animation is just superb in this for sure we have to get we have to give it uh, like we have to really give it to the studio because this is amazing on the the animation and the fights in this but the just the small like the one-liners and the comedy in this is just too like just talk just the way some of these characters come off just had me dying i think i just don't you don't expect it from because there's so many serious parts in this when they go from talking about these curses and a life or death situations to talking about what type of girl you're into and do, or do you like big boobs or big ass like that or like that that shit is just funny that that's just so drastic and difference but that's totally my style i've said this before i love dark comedy so i like like dark or horror thing you know just things that are very um very hard to handle or uh tough situations but mix it in with some comedy and stuff and it's perfect and this really has that tone and i think that's why i've gotten into this show so much it just hits like everything that i like in an anime like it just it, it's a nice blend to me what is uh you guys let me know in the comments what do you like most about this show is there a certain aspect of it um like a certain style of this show or is it just the fights the animation you guys let me know in the comments down below what's your favorite uh part of this show uh but anyway i'm just excited i can't wait until the uh the next episode i find myself like this is this is that show uh I, this season because re-zero was kind of like that for me last season where you're just waiting for the episode this one i just can't wait until the next episode